Okay, y'all. I'm about to make a uh, what's the name of it? God, I had a brain fart. I can't even remember what I was about to tell y'all. I'm about to make um, rotel dip. I'm about to make some rotel dip, and I'm about to put that in a crock pot and get it going. That's gonna be one of our dinners today. That and some meatballs. Simple. We'll have to have a heavy dinner every day. But that's what we're going to have today. It looks so pretty outside. And nice and peaceful. Let's walk out and see. Oh, no. I saw a lizard. We ain't going to walk out and see. <laughs> yeah, I'm scared. I saw a lizard. I'm like, oh, no. Oh, no. We're going to stay in the house. But y'all, okay. this is the start of my Rotel dip. It just has the Velveeta cheese, the Rotel, two cans of Rotel, and a brown hamburger meat and put it in the slow cooker. You can add cream cheese. If I had some, I would. But today, I don't have the cream cheese because I used them all on my jalapeno poppers. But I'm just going to let this go on low for a couple of hours. I'll let you know exactly how many um, when I as I mix it. All right, y'all, it's been about 30 minutes. So it's starting to melt. So I'm just going to begin stirring it. That's why you want to leave your Rotel liquids in it because going to help with the dip. You see those liquids at the bottom? This is one of my favorite dips to make because my kids love it. And this is how it looks after I've been stirring for a little while. And then I'm going to put the lid back on and let it continue. Y'all, I finally got my sub. Calvin just bought it on his lunch break. Okay, y'all. I'm on my way to Walmart to go get some of the items that I need for dinner. I'm going to make a pasta or dinner. Slash, I think I'm going to uh, take some food to work for work tomorrow. I don't know. So, one of the things that I plan to uh, make is a pasta. Well, I don't know. I, I take that back. I might not be uh, bringing lunch tomorrow because I never liked the idea of putting my food in the uh, refrigerator at work. I know when I was working in office, people was opening people trays and eating out their food and stuff like grown people. So, I'm kind of on the fence that it was sent fence of with that and I don't want to leave it in the car and I'm making pasta salads so I don't want it to be in the car with mayonnaise in it and then go sour so I think I might just go and get me a sub or something that'll probably be the best thing the subway over there has the seafood sub that I like so I may get that but um Y'all, Shane did the same thing I told him this morning not to do, which was get out at work without checking the schedule and letting Calvin leave. He had to wait for a whole hour for Calvin to pick him back up because Calvin went to my mama house. His phone went dead. So when his phone went dead, he stayed over there charging his phone up. Then when he finally looked at his phone and saw that he had missed calls from Shane, it was already an hour had done passed. Luckily, he hadn't just come home with his phone dead and with the Walmart and all of that before he went to my mama house so you can imagine him having to just wait but if he'd have listened to me when I told him before you let Calvin pull off tell him let you go check the schedule first they don't listen like he just knew he was on the schedule today so I'm gonna make a uh, bow tie pasta bow tie seafood pasta um that's what i have a taste for i made some meatballs and some rotel dip 
So I'm gonna add my bow tie pasta with that. And um, that's gonna be our meal for the night, something simple. I have to take my cube steak out of the um take it out of the fridge out of the freezer when I get home. So in the morning before I leave for work, I can go ahead and drop the uh, cube steak in and then it be ready once I get off of work. So that'll be a good little thing to get home and don't have to worry about cooking. Because I have to go back in the office Wednesday. Y'all, I'm so excited. We finally booked the building for my sister's baby shower. So we know for sure where we're going to have it at. Know how many tables we're going to have. Know how the building is going to look. Um, we're actually, me and Diane's actually hiring a decorator. Um, the same decorator that did Adanya's baby shower. So excited about that. I will be cooking a lot of the food and preparing a lot of the food for the baby shower. So I'm excited about that. Um, the building has a full kitchen. So I'm extra excited about that. We don't have to worry about ice because the building comes with the ice. Um, we just have to, you know, get the drink dispensers. I have, well, I was about to say I have one and my sister had one, but then I think she broke hers. So I think we're gonna have to um, get a get two either two different dispensers or buy another one that matches. And I don't even sure they have them because we both got ours from Sam. So we just gotta get it together. Um, the date even changed. It's gonna be December the seventh. We were looking for it to be December the fourteenth, but that's okay. Like it's earlier than. It, it's earlier than the date we didn't want to have it which was the 21st so that's a plus it'll all work out we have some other ladies helping us plan um, the baby shower as well one of her good friends Shayla as well as her friend Sherilyn and LaShonda so all of us together I'm sure we're going to make you know they're putting their two cents in the um and help contributing to the baby shower. So that's plus to always have, you know, extra people helping. So I'm excited about that. And yeah, of course, like I said, I'm gonna bring y'all along. So I'm on my way again to Walmart and I'll see y'all when I get in Walmart cause I feel like I'm rambling right about now. But yeah, I'll see y'all when I get in Walmart. Met up with my sister in Walmart and she's walking to her car now but I met up with my sister in Walmart I meant to show her but my sister is just like Calvin she knows everybody because she used to work at a she's a, a manager so they had her switching amongst a lot of different stores so she knows just about everybody <laughs> so she done held like five conversations and finally i went walking to the register and the girl about we about to give you back your sister i'm like uh-uh i'm about to go <laughs> y'all can have her <sighs> no oh shoot i think i'm going the wrong way this 18 wheeler is right here let me all taking up the space so uh let me get home so i can finish up dinner and i need to be in bed early tonight i need to edit this video so i can have something to upload because when i get home it'll probably be about six o'clock 
if not seven o'clock tomorrow, depending on how traffic look. Cause I get off at five. So I'll be in that five o'clock traffic coming home. Luckily when I get home, hopefully everybody will be home. So I see y'all when I get to the house. Hey y'all, this is my plate. <laughs> the pasta salad. I cook some garlic shrimp. I have my meatballs and my hamburger dip. All right, y'all. I'm back to end the vlog. We ate dinner. Calvin just brought me a beautiful bath water and surprised me with candles <laughs> around the tub. So it is pretty, Calvin. Thank you so much. He turned the little heater in on in there about the heat, about the overheat me, but okay. it was nice. Okay, y'all see that? All right. <laughs> no, it was nice, Calvin. Okay. It's just a little humid in there. All right. But he got the little heat going, so it'll be nice and toasty. Got me a candle going. Yep. So I'm about to enjoy this and get ready for my work day tomorrow. Of course, I'm going to take y'all with me. And I'll see y'all on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.